you know, as artists, we're called by God. We're, we have these God-given talents that we're called to use, and so we're created by God to create things. I was here as a freshman. I was just loving the fact that just people here liked drawing. Josh came next year, and he told me that he was thinking of doing an art club. I was like, oh, hey, I could totally help you, and I'd be totally down in helping you start this art club and run it and do whatever you need me to do. So I started the club in hopes to do that, and it's just a really great opportunity to come together and, and learn and practice. The students wanted to be able to congregate together and like explore their different art styles and see each other's and, and be able to collaborate and like just have fun together. We have weekly meetings. Each quarter it kind of changes, but you know it's an hour and a half-ish uh, long, and we just hang out and draw, paint, whatever kind of art form you want to bring. The benefit from that is learning from each other because we're discovering things all at the same, relatively at the same time. And we all have different styles, which I think is probably the most fun part. Being able to get together, see everybody's own creative style and the techniques they use and, and being able to share that with each other, you're all able to grow and learn from that. Josh had all these great ideas for more than just getting together and drawing. He had challenges he wanted to do, art projects, and then we developed the idea of doing like an art show. There was uh, an art gallery just down the street, so I went to talk with them, and they were more than willing to, you know, host us there, and they said they would even be happy to host us in future years as well. So much planning went into it, so it was really great to just see it all come to fruition, and it was really rewarding. If I recall correctly, we had around 20 participants in the show with around 33 pieces. Well, there's a lot of people there. We had so many students who came in. We actually had Professor Nicolini and Professor Holbert come to judge the pieces, and we had two awards, Best in Show and Honorable Mention. It was really cool going to the gallery, having all these people show up, both from the school and just from around the area, come and see my work and everyone else who submitted work. It was really, really surreal. It's, it's a nice feeling, just feeling like your work is being enjoyed because at the end of the day, that's kind of what you do it for. Like, I mean, a lot of artists say like, oh, I do it to get like my feelings out. And that's part of it too, but it's also like to be enjoyed and to make people smile. We'd like to do an art show at least every year. In between that, we've thought about doing like smaller art shows, maybe themed. I think it would be cool for like the art show to become like a bigger event and to have it more often to like celebrate that fact. And also it's really cool to graduate and already have on your resume that you were in a gallery show. Seeing my work on display in a professional art gallery was, it was really cool and it gave me a lot of excitement and enthusiasm for the future and what else I could do from this experience. The very first time I did an art club meeting, so that was a really cool moment of like, wow, these people love drawing and they're just going to sit here and draw with me. And that was just so fun and everyone was smiling and everyone was so excited just to be together doing something that they loved. So definitely we start out with like a basic map of where is everything going to be, where are the eyes and the proportions. Picking a spot to start I think is the most difficult part for me. So I tend to go in the parts where there's like the darkest or where there's no light. So in these areas and up here is where I started. And then kind of moved